What is up guys? It's a wanted turtle. We're coming back with a more another Pokemon opening. We are doing more unbroken bonds. Um, we are on a hot streak, so we're going to be pressing our luck. I'm, <laughs> I'm really hoping I don't I don't jinx us, but uh so we're definitely opening more unbroken bonds. We're doing 12 more packs, getting into a fresh booster box. And uh yeah, looking uh we, we're still looking for our first Reshiram Charizard. Uh, but beyond that, we are doing great, especially when it comes to uh, pulling Sylveon and Gardevoir. We can, we seem to pull that every single time, um, which I'm totally cool with. Uh, even though we haven't hit all the tag teams, uh, I'm fine with that just because that that's a very good strong card. And uh, and actually, the the one of the cards that I was really excited about is the um, Whimsicott, and I actually did see a. Um, video from Tricky Jim where he does use it and they use the Porygon Z uh, to basically accelerate the special energies just because Porygon Z can do as many as he wants which is pretty insane so I'm really happy that Whimsicott's finally uh, seeing some action and obviously his uh, passive ability can can help him just gives him a lot more survivability so let's quickly jump into our first pack and we'll kind of keep talking about it but uh yeah i was really happy to see that metapod we got a koga's trap still feel like this card is really bad but i feel like i see it used still we got a ghastly tangela venonet oh a reverse polywag with this art and then we have a aromatist for our first booster pack not bad um <clears throat> Still haven't seen much with Muck, so I'm kind of still disappointed by that. Still, um, keep my fingers crossed that someone will figure out how to make them work. Uh, but I was really happy to see the Whimsicott for sure. All right, let's move on to pack number two. We got a Grass Energy, Chat It, Mulane, Frogadier, Murkrow, Oddish, Mistrevious, Salandit, a Glammeow. Reverse Gas Lee and then a Meow Stick. Hmm, so kind of a slow start. Let's jump into Burning Shadows. Nothing um, make me happier than getting a particular Rainbow Rare from this pack. All right, let's see what we got. We got a Darkness Energy, Blufflunt, Electric. Rhydon, Mudbray, Alola Rattata, Pampor, Caterpie, a Porygon, a Sock for the Reverse, and then a Lycanroc. Uh, not bad, at least we got a Hollow. And we'll move back to Unbroken Bonds. As always, guys, if you do want to support the channel, you can simply do so by hitting that like button down below. And uh, definitely, if you're not subscribed, if you're new to the channel, uh, definitely subscribe. You know, we do Pokemon videos essentially every day, and we'll mix in some Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic the Gathering in there as well. Green's Exploration, very nice card. Uh, seeing quite a bit of play, My, as far as, like, the channels I watch for uh, kind of like the competitive PTCGO Cottony and then Venonat our reverse is a seal followed by a Agron I'm not sure if I ever looked at this uh, during your opponent's next turn this Pokemon is damaged by an attack even if it's put 8 damage hmm that's not bad but they're pretty high at cost and this is already a stage 2 then Giga Impact 160 can't use it next turn um I feel like it's pretty strong but it's just too slow too too high evolution and stuff like that but uh yeah the porygon z deck the whimsicott porygon z i feel like that's really nice um and i guess it makes sense for them both to be in this set because they kind of feel like they were made to play off of each other all right we have a poly world getting ready for that belly flop togepi pikachu very cool art murkrow rhyhorn a meltan reverse is a litten that it always looks a little faded to me. And then a Arbuck. So we're starting off pretty slow. Oh, we also hasn't pulled the Machamp Marshadow. That's another one I'm fine with. I feel like that card's pretty bad. All right, will we get our first hit in this pack? Still looking for our first Reshiram Charizard. That's definitely the card where I'm hoping to find the most. We have a Spearow, Lickitung, Another Fade Litten, Krabby, 
Ooh, reverse Gengar. Very nice. Very cool. And then we have... Ooh, Dedene. Ah, oh, this card is super good. It's kind of like a... Um, imagine if you were to Tapu Lele into a Cynthia and then use it. This is all that in one, in one card. And it doesn't take up your supporter for the turn. And yeah, so really good. I feel like if he... He doesn't belong on the battlefield. <laughs> He doesn't belong in the active position, but uh, a very good uh, tech card just to kind of help cycle your deck. And um, that was the thing for like the Dene's, or actually he's good for any deck, but when it came to that Whimsicott um, Porygon build, you know, you did need a lot of ways to basically continue to draw through your through your deck so that when once you do have Porygon Z out there, um, just via like Rare Candy um, versus like evolving them twice, you just keep drawing more cards and they keep slapping on all like the double colorless triple acceleration energy onto whimsicott so that his um whatever called attack energy something uh basically does max damage and wow this is dud back so <laughs> went through it without even noticing all right so we did get one gx and that's a very good one in did eh? i feel like except for the fact that we have not um, pull the Reshiram Charizard. I feel like our Unbroken Bonds luck is very good. Uh, pulling the the ones that matter. You know, a lot of those Gardevoir, Sylveons, and then Dedene as well. It's our second one, I believe. We've got Chipax. Diglett coming out of nowhere. That art of the Poliwag, guys. Rhyhorn. Gro Growlithe. Cubone. Oddish. Let's see. I think we have something right here. Got Boom! Oh my god! <laughs> All right, guys, this is the chase card of the set. Um, this is the one everyone is looking for, and there we go. Um, so glad we got this on camera. We're, we need to double sleeve this one. Wow, insane pull right there. Um, yeah, I think I saw like this thing going for like $300. I think the price has come down because that's pretty absurd. Um, but still, this is an awesome pull. Can't believe we pulled this. Definitely, this is one that will be going to PSA. Actually, let's see how the... Yeah, and the back looks super clean. Centering. I feel like the bottom is slightly thicker than the top. But um, yeah, beyond the centering, this thing looks awesome. There we go, guys. Hit that like button down below to help me celebrate in pulling the chase card. Um, except I feel like this thing is close. It's like up there with the uh, rainbow Charizard. So this is like the next next big thing. So wow, what an amazing opening. We got a, a hyper rare, a Dedene. Um, and you know what? We're going to press our luck. Let's see if we can't find that rainbow Charizard as well. That would make like the most insane video, insane Pokemon opening, probably like on YouTube. So let's see if we can't make a miracle happen. Even if we can't, I am so happy we got that card. Um, you know, looking for our first Reshiram Charizard and to, and to get that one uh, for our first one is absolutely insane. So happy with that. All right, Crow Brawler. We got an Inke for the... Was it the reverse? No, it's not. We have a Charmeleon. Ooh, Charmeleon reverse. And then boom. Ah, just a Slow King. Uh, not going to complain too much. All right, so I feel like we can call it um, claim victory on Unbroken Bonds. All the ones that we haven't hit, like the Marshadow, the Lucario, I'm fine with. And we just pulled the most valuable card in the set by, I don't know, a huge margin. Um, man, I can't believe we just did that. All right, for our reverse, we got a Wooper and then the Rick and Morty Weezing. Uh, I can't even concentrate right now, guys. Um, wow, I can't believe we did that. I feel like our booster boxes, we started with a dud of a booster box with no secret rare. I think we, I think we just had a full art, and that's literally it. Since then, things have been leveling up like crazy, and uh, I'm not sure how a box can get better than, than what we just did. We got the, the Poliwhirl just evolved into Poliwrath after doing that belly flop, and then followed by a big spaghetti monster. Whew, we got three packs left. We already hit the best card in the set. We got a the best tech, um, kind of like tech card uh, in the Dedene. 
Whew, is there anything left that we even we even need? Ooh, triple center acceleration, nice. Rhydon, Cubone, Crow Brawler, Sandile, Oddish, Zubat, a Krabby, followed by the Per Ugly taking a bath. All right, we got two packs left. I'm like sweating from that pool. <laughs> Oh, guys, definitely show some love. Um, yeah, spread the word that we just got the best card in the set, bar none, by far. We got a Goldeen, Darumaka, Sandile, Salandit. Ooh, surprise Bach Reverse. This, I, I guess we did find one reason to use this card, and then a Marowak. All right, last pack in the opening. I don't even, we don't need anything else. We're... We already won, but to finish things off, we have a Darkness Energy, Welder, Laron, Gliscor, Diglett, Interesting Art, Tentacool, Drowsy, a Togepi for the Reverse, and then a Volcanion. Let me see, search your deck for Fire Energy and attach it to one of your Pokemon. If you go second your first turn, search up to three. Interesting. Hmm. All right, that's uh, not that great, but interesting card. Um, so there you guys have it. We just pulled the best card in the set. Uh, so really happy about that. Um, as always, if you do want to show support, simply like, comment, and subscribe all down below and help me celebrate our massive poll. Um, all that, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Juan Turtle, and we'll catch you guys next time. Peace.